Hello everyone, it's Paul Lynch here and I'm just going to demonstrate an amazing new feature that we've just added to Easy Sketch Pro. This is version 1.08. It's available to download right now. Okay, so once the software is open, we click on the image icon here. And for the first time you'll see this extra button here called Add to Library. Now what this allows you to do is once you click on that button, it allows you to create your own library folder which will then appear down the left hand side here so you can save and store your own images so for this example I'm going to put name this folder Christmas okay and simply because in the members area you can download I think something like 18 folders of SGVs that we've downloaded for you and within here we have lots of different variety ones but we do have some Christmas images so let's say I've got this zip folder full of SVG images and lots of different uh, categories and topics and I want to really dissect them and use them for my own personal use okay so that's why I've named the folder Christmas and they also also if you're doing this on your own you must have a PNG and an SVG of the same image so this Christmas one up the top is the PNG because I can see the image that's the thumbnail and the one next to it is the SVG image and both images must be named the same so for example this one's called Christmas underscore one and so is the is the SVG image okay so going uh, back to the software so I've named my new folder Christmas and then I'm going to locate the SVGs that are in the folder that I've just showed you. So for this example, I'm just going to pick the first four. You can pick as many as you want, or you can just keep hold of control and pick all the different ones as you're going through. Okay, so for this example, I'm just going to pick the first four. Then I'm going to click Open. And then from here, I'm going to click OK. And as you can see, the four images have been added. So press OK again. But from now you can't see a Christmas folder, so we need to press the refresh button here and watch what happens in alphabetical order in, in here for Christmas. Press the refresh button, and there we have our Christmas folder. So we go into our Christmas folder and we've got all the images in there that will work perfectly with the software.